Hello everybody, good morning. <clears throat> this is Mo Chat and it is 10.23 a.m. and it's October 31st, 2016. Guess what? It's Halloween. Yay! Woohoo! Go get all your candy tonight. Brush your teeth. Oh, probably at least six times. You're going to need it. Especially if you eat all that candy. Okay. All right, let's get on to more serious things, because we know what Mo is, right? Mo is all about getting serious. Okay. <clears throat> also, got to plug in my laptop before it dies on me. <clears throat> I'm telling you, the day that they make laptops and tablets that do not die, I will be a very grateful person. Okay, let's talk about earthquakes. In the description below, I am going to give you a link to a Twitter page called Earthquake Kit Guides. On their page, they have a report. I will also attempt to give you a link to that report as well that they are talking about. I will also publish the fair use statement okay because I am allowed to mention that as long as I give the credit to them and post the link to that okay so we shall do that now nine hours ago 2.7 in Yonteville California okay that's the one I'm gonna start out with 2.7 a hundred and six people are reporting on this earthquake. A hundred and six people. Very, 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 looks like populated area there. Um, north of San Francisco. Um, east of Santa Rosa. West of Sacramento. Right there by Fairfield, Vacaville, Concord. Um, <clears throat> it's called Yontville. 2.7. It was only 7.5 kilometers deep, and like I said, 106 people have reported on this 2.7 earthquake. So we want to keep that in mind, okay? All right. Another thing going on is that Salton Sea is acting up again real close to the Salton Sea in a place they call Nyland remember we had all those swarms and stuff going on around Nyland California today it is happening again <clears throat> whole bunch of little earthquakes right there 1.7 and earlier they had a 3.0 we will take a quick look at all of those going on Nyland 2.8 kilometers deep a 1.7 okay so let's just run down the line and see what we can do here in the last nine hours Nyland Nyland 2.0 2.4 is another swarm going to begin right there near that Salton Sea remember I did reports about the Salton Sea area and all the mud pots and stuff going on hot mud pots what does that tell you there is heat down there okay remember I like to talk about volcanoes and earthquakes hot sounds to me like there's a volcano maybe a small one but it's under there something is under there that is boiling up and they're having those earthquakes again 3.1 also in Nylon six hours ago <clears throat> one person's reporting on that one and guess what it's right on the edge of that Salton Sea Nyland California is right there next to that Salton Sea that one is a 3.1 and it's only 3 kilometers deep okay <clears throat> so we're giving you the best that we've got here 
How about a 3.4 southwest of Nyland, okay? 8 kilometers southwest of Nyland, California, a 3.4 earthquake. And 3.3 kilometers deep. Only one person reporting there as well. Okay, let's see if we can find some more. 2.0, 2.4. We can continue here. 2.9. Five hours ago, 2.9. 2.4 kilometers deep. No one's reporting that one. <clears throat> so, what have we got? Five hours, six hours. There's five hours, six hours. One, two, three, four. Well, there's four in approximately a two hour time frame six hours ago. Six to seven hours ago, they had four. Now let's move forward in time just a little bit. Five, looks like five of them. Six of them, another 3.0 in Nyland. Another 3.3, 2.4, 2.3, this is 5 hours ago, 6 hours ago, 7 hours ago, okay, lots of them, I've mentioned at least 10 earthquakes ranging in the 2 point and up, okay, 2 point and up, <clears throat> and that salt and sea. It listed again, but it changes it to Nyland. A 3.6 is what it says, and then it changes it to a 3.0. You know what? At this point, I don't care if they change the name of the town or not. It's Salton Sea. It's right there. Within a few kilometers, Salton Sea and Nyland is right there. More than 10 earthquakes happening there, and they are two pointers and up. Two pointers and up. <clears throat> the list here is here in front of me. 2.1. And what is going on in Arkansas? Oh my goodness. A 2.3 in Blytheville, Arkansas. Nine kilometers deep. That is that connection between Arkansas and Tennessee, the very border there, just outside of Jonesboro, a 2.3 in Arkansas. I realize I just jumped across the United States, but that's a little bit surprising to me. I have not heard of an, Ar of an Arkansas earthquake before. That kind of makes me nervous right there. What about King City? King City, California. <clears throat> That's just south of Fresno. It is away from that Salton Sea, thank goodness. But it is a 3.3. No one's reporting on it. It was only 8 kilometers deep. And that was 4 hours ago. A lot of 1.9, 1.9 on the edge of twos there. 2.3, Nylon. Nylon again, repeatedly, repeatedly. It looks like a little bit of a swarm going on. 3.0 again an hour ago. Right there, Nylon, California. And in Nicaragua, a 4.4, Corinto, Nicaragua. Just out there on that coastline, right headed toward the um, Middle America Trench. It is a 4.4 .4 earthquake, and they say it's 35 kilometers in depth. Way out there. Okay, that is your earthquake report for right now. I'm so sorry I have to leave you this morning. Gotta go to work. 
Mary is in her work uniform. Got to go. Okay? Have a wonderful day. Please read the report that I am going to give you a link to. It is a very important report about oil and gas fracking going on. Okay? Deep well digging water injection sites, waste injection sites has a lot to do with causing earthquakes, man-made earthquakes. Near to or very close to where people live, putting people's lives in danger. Tell me what you think about this report. I am going to share it with you this morning, and I will talk to you about it later. I will be back this afternoon around 3.30. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. I'll catch up with you later. Bye.